Scabies is a skin condition that results from the human itch mite burrowing under the skin to live and feed, typically resulting in varying levels of discomfort and distress on the part of the human host. The parasite is widespread and not specific to any geographical location or socioeconomic condition. While prolonged skin-to-skin -skin contact is the most commonly recognized method of transmission, the mites can survive for up to four days off of humans, and easily pass from one person to another via infested bedding, furniture, towels, and similar items. Fortunately, modern treatments have shortened the recovery time of humans infected with the parasite. However, it is highly advisable to implement a thorough cleaning regimen to eliminate the potential for further spread and infestation. Scabies infestations typically involve extreme itching in the infected area, rashes, sores, and thickly crusted skin. The itching has been documented to be so severe it can keep a person awake at night. The rashes can appear as tiny pimples, bites, or hives and can develop into scaly skin, often confused for eczema. Scratching the rashes can result in open sores, leading to further infections, specifically sepsis. The most severe infection, commonly called Norwegian scabies, can lead to skin crusting. The most common areas on the human body where scabies occur are the hands between the fingers and nails, armpits and elbows, and locations on the body typically covered by clothing or jewelry, like wedding bands. The demographic most vulnerable to scabies infections are individuals with weakened immune systems, children, mothers with young children, and residents in long-term care facilities. Those with AIDS, HIV, leukemia, and lymphoma or recent recipients of organ transplants are considered at higher risk. Due to the elevated amount of prolonged direct contact, patients and nurses in assisted living facilities are also at a higher risk, especially from crusted scabies, which can survive for up to a week without human contact, and spreads rapidly via infested linens and furniture. If you believe you, your children, or one of your employees or students have scabies, the infected person must seek medical attention immediately. While the parasite is relatively benign, the infestation can lead to further severe mental and physical health issues that directly impact performance and well-being. On the day that treatment begins, strip all bedding, towels, sheets, pillows, and pillowcases, wash them in warm water, and dry them at high heat for at least 30 minutes. Anything that can't be washed at home should be taken to a dry cleaner, who should be notified of the issue. Anything that can't be washed or dry cleaned, such as rugs or curtains, should be placed on high heat for at least 30 minutes in your dryer. Vacuum all carpets, rugs, and upholstery, including couches and chairs, with a high-performance HEPA-filtered vacuum cleaner. Ensure that anyone responsible for cleaning wears the appropriate protective gear and that all clothing is washed and dried on high heat immediately upon completion. Infestations can be difficult to detect and diagnose, but once a medical confirmation has been obtained and treatment has begun, it is vital that the facility is cleaned immediately. If you would like to learn more, or if you need assistance cleaning your facility, contact us today.